Hi, Jeremy. Hi, Maneeb. It's nice to meet you and finally good to see you in Pakistan. <laughs> yes, good to see you again. <laughs> yes. That's nice. First of all, I would like to appreciate uh -huh. the efforts that you have been doing in the Pakistani market. Mm -hmm. You have been doing such great seminars like the one you have managed today. Yes. And I really, really appreciate it and we really hope that the seminars and these marketing activities will definitely definitely motivate our ex entrepreneurs of uh, Pakistan mm -hmm. and will help them you know, join the other platform mm -hmm. in, the, in the coming time. Okay, so my first question what kind of policies or what kind of actions uh, are you taking or Alibaba.com is implementing for in the fiscal year 25 in the uh, next year so what are your plans to promote the Pakistani sellers and to improve uh, and to increase the growth on Alibaba platform uh, okay good question very good question uh, to promote uh, the Pakistani uh, B2B e-commerce uh, we are planning to uh, release a new product it's an, an entry level it, we will lower the cost and oh. uh, also will be uh, including some uh, free functions like AI which equipped us with AI and a lower the price. So it will be benefit for Pakistan sellers, SMEs to join our platform. Yes. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Talking about the e-commerce industry and talking about the sellers of uh, specifically talking about Lahore City. Yes. What have your uh, what are your different feedback from these uh, sellers and what are you uh, going to do in this uh, new cities, Lahore and Karachi uh, uh, to, uh, to also onboard yeah. them on this platform? First of all, I have have been uh, knowing Lahore for more than five years and uh, I saw it was a dynamic mm -hmm. uh, city in, in Pakistan and it's uh, also the best economy uh, city in Lahore and uh, I also visited some of the industry zone I saw a lot of companies but yeah. uh, after interview with uh, after talking with them some uh, didn't know in Alibaba.com so okay. still we have a lot of chance to get developed awareness of them to let them know alibaba.com most of them they only know alibaba.com is only can buy something but they don't know they can sell something yes, yes. so we need to let them know about this yes that's, I mean, that's really great of you mm -hmm. you're edu actually educating and uh, yes. training the new cities and people yes. in the new cities mm -hmm. okay so and uh, another question that i know most of the pakistani sellers <laughs> would have that in their mind right now mm -hmm. and that is uh, what payment gateway and when can we expect a payment gateway or something like a trade assurance in Pakistan. Is there any possibility in the near future in your, or is it part of your next year plan? Uh, this is a very comprehensive uh, question. Uh, first of all, if we want to make uh, uh, trade assurance, first we have to have a local local company. Uh, this is the first, uh, first one. Uh, but um, uh, when we talk about the trade assurance, most uh, we are talking about the payment gateway. They need uh, some third party to uh, make sure their money is safety between the sellers and uh, the, the, the buyers. That, uh, right now we didn't have direct uh, strategies for payment uh, trade assurance, but we have some other solutions like VM. So verify the, so verify the supply, we will uh, let the buyers more trust in sellers. Thank you so much. Thank you, okay. for, your, uh, thank you for answering your questions. Thank you. Thank you. It's my honor.